Of course, it's Sunday, and this is open house time. If you're planning to check some out today, listen up, because there are new rules that will affect how you buy and sell real estate, and that's due to a landmark $418 million settlement by the National Association of Realtors. Joining us today is Lance Owens. He is the president-elect of Hawaii Realtors. Good to have you, Lance. Thank you for inviting me. We're going to break it all down, because, you know, when we talk about <laughs> home buying, we just, I guess it's an expectation that the seller covers the 6% commission um, and then that's split between the buyer and the agent. It's kind of interesting because that comes up a lot. You know, in the, in the settlement, even prior to the settlement, it's always been negotiable. So there's blank spots when a listing agent goes in to list the property that, that they talk to the seller about what kind of services they want. There's flat fees, there's um, in, you know, percentages, things like that. Mm -hmm. So it's always been blank, so it hasn't been set at 6%. I think that's where a lot of the confusions come in. Okay, well, yeah. break it all down. So what right. exactly is different now? What is different now? So now the buyers are going to be required to actually sign a buyer's agreement, and that's a requirement. We don't have a choice. And that's at any point that they're going to go in and tour a home. So whether they're doing it in person or if they're doing it virtually, because many of us mm -hmm. do it virtually. So that, so my big thing is be kind to your realtor because they're going to be fumbling through this. Mm -hmm. The safety nets were removed yesterday <laughs> and uh, it's going to be a requirement. They're going to have to have that signing. Okay. And we do have some graphics that uh, we can just pull oh, that great. as we're talking just so okay. that people understand, you know, negotiation has always been part of this deal, Always but I guess <laughs> it just makes it more transparent that you yeah. can negotiate these fees between the buyer and the seller. Exactly, and I think that's the biggest thing that they wanted to get out to the public because it always has been. There's nothing that's changed with that, but they want it in big, bold letters on that buyer's agreement and on that, that listing agreement. And I think the big thing with the buyers that they wanted to get out there is, is the buyer now can prior to, the, to even go out and showing can dictate what his agent or her agent is going to get. Mm -hmm. So that's where the big thing is. So, so with that agreement, it's going to be stated prior to the buyer signing that. And on there, there'll be spaces to, to whether it's a flat fee or whether it's a percentage or it's an hourly rate, whatever that is. But the interesting thing that they're making clear now is that if, say, a seller is offering more than what a buyer has agreed to, uh, that that buyer's agent can't get that, so that it would be available to either discount the price or go to the. Uh, I'm sorry, the the seller would be able to give that to the buyer, discount the price, uh, but not to the buyer's agent. So that okay. new contract specifically will state that. All right. Well, that, it's all meant really to help buyers and yeah. uh, sellers yeah. in this market that yeah. has been <laughs> very uh, much uh, uh, unpredictable. Yeah. Uh, in mid-September, they will have the uh, Fed is expected to cut the interest rate. So how do you think all of this will factor in? I think it's going to help. I don't think it's going to change much in the pricing of the homes with this, with these changes. But I think with the Fed's coming in with the rates, we're going to see some, some uh, movement again in the housing. So I think it, it'll be good. And again, the transparency is good because everybody understands up front. That's been, they've been working on that for years now. Okay, so, so it's just now in paper, in and writing. Now it's in writing, okay. bold letters, and it's clear. All right, for more so, information, where yeah. can people go real quickly? Facts.realtor. So the Realtor, National Association of Realtors put out this website, and there's several pages and explains everything more in depth. All right, well, thank go you. educate yourselves, yeah. learn more about it.